Hello and welcome guys hope you are doing well welcome in the next video of EMS course uh, hopefully you have watched the previous videos as uh, previous videos is required in order to move forward in the last video we have basically fetch events from the fire store and display uh, each or individual event detail so in this video we are going to implement the favorite or unfavorite where you guys can say like or unlike uh, feature in the app so as you guys you can see i have a variable for the likes that is basically uh, getting length of the likes field uh, so if i click on this i can it should increment to one and uh, if it is gray then it should uh, then it should be transformed to the red but if it's red and then i click on it it should be transformed to the black so how we can do this let's implement it <clears throat> first of all i'm going to create a separate list list and its name is likes likes or user likes initially it's empty but we can we can get the value from here user likes and then I have to remove this length user likes initialize it with the empty list uh, as we are using list for uh, associating or finding out user likes so we don't need any more this like variable so we have to remove this right and uh, before and uh, and then we have to then we have to use this likes list instead of the like variable user likes length so basically we will be getting length from here and uh, another thing is this is basically the heart or the favorite icon so if user like user likes dot contain i have to call contain if user like contain my file my id this means i have already liked this event so it should be red color but if it's not containing my UID, this means I have not liked it here. It should be black anyway. Uh, colors. It should be colors not black. Now one more thing is okay. So now we have to move toward this, and we have to implement the inkwell so we can handle on tab on tab in the child so now let's make this element favorite if it's not but if it is favorite then we have to make it unfavorite if user likes dot contains firebase auth dot current user dot uid so if it contain my uid this means I have already favorite so I should have to unfavorite it so the same thing uh, we have to firebase firestore dot instance collection the collection name is basically events right uh, dot document which document the selected document so i have to check for the selected document data controllers okay okay event data is the selected document event event data dot id dot set dot
in case of set please make sure you always call the set options okay likes field value dot array remove what I have to remove is my UID this but if it is not but if it's not like already then we have to add it in a list array uni now let's check the magic I'm going to control s to start it I'm going to click on the heart okay so something went wrong it is saying that likes is not there okay no problem mm. these are likes okay so according to the operation they are saying that uh, like is not uh, or you can say field does not exist error let me figure it out guys I have made a very strange uh, you guys can say very error thrown error uh, this is because I have used set method without mentioning the set options if you not mention the set options you will prob probably feel or you will probably face the error it's because it just basically remove all the information except this line so it, you should have to make it set merge option true so if i can show you the document in the firebase it's basically removed all the information that is associated with this event so this is nice mistake because you guys uh, will learn from this that if you use set uh, then you should have to probably use set options as well now let me remove this delete yeah and you guys will see it will be recovered yeah you have got it let's give it a restart and now I'm going to click on the heart icon yeah it turned uh, red and also the value is incremented if I click it again it's blue sorry black and value zero so that's how basically we implement like and unlike favorite or uh, I have already uh, also implemented bookmark with the same way so hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video thanks for watching